Good evening, brothers and sisters in the Lord. And also, good evening to our live stream viewers. Please like and share this video so others may also be blessed. And now, let's all rise and shall we offer hand claps to our living God. May I call the one assigned for the scripture reading and followed by the opening prayer. Let us open our Bibles to the book of uh, Let us open our Bibles to the book of Matthew 25 in protection O their God that the works of the enemy the plans of the enemy O God could not snatch your word Lord from our hearts Lord in Jesus name and Lord thank you their God Saturate this place, Lord, with your holy presence, O God. And thank you, dear God, for your Shekinah glory, Lord, will fall down, O God. Rest upon us, Lord, this very evening, Lord. Thank you, God. Cover us, Lord, with thy most precious blood, O Jesus. Thank you, Lord, as we commit everything into your loving hands, Lord, tonight. Thank you, O God. It is you will bless also, O God, the viewer, O God, the listeners of your word tonight. O oh Lord, thank you so much, O oh dear God, for your blessing, Lord. Everything, Lord, as we depend on you, God, Holy Spirit, thank you for the deep understanding of your word, O oh God, this very moment, this very evening, O oh God. We came to your presence, O oh God, as hungry and thirst, O oh God, of your word, Lord. And thank you, O oh God, it is you will satisfy us tonight, O oh Lord God. Lord, thank you, God, for everything, Lord, as you work, O oh God, in our hearts, Lord. We commit everything into your loving hands, O oh God. The body balance of this service. Thank you, O oh God. In your name, Jesus, we ask and pray. Amen. Shall we sing the song, I love to be in your presence?
Uh, good evening, everyone. Uh, este di mio testimony, no? Tadayo, gracias kun Lord, kay si Lord Bembueno gayot, no? Hindi kita pwede kunta, el di suyo pa ka bueno, ko saleta ase na di aton kaday kual bida, no? Praise the Lord, no? Dakel di, ha? Yaan da yuste na pueblo. Uno del mga ayin na pueblo, ko sa pasay? Siya pingkuan, yaan da yung mga kompre. No sabi yo, cuando para sale a yo, aquel ba o chen, hindi ba chen, ese ta suena, suena, no? Ta suena man, ang sino si entra y ta suena, pero no hay, no hay pa chequea con yo. Cuando para volvida a yo, ya ano, ya suena ya tamen. Na ya agara di mi yo, ya manda conmigo bira. Ano manda bira conmigo, ya saca di mi yo carga. Habli, ¿por qué man? Habli, bene, a la que el security, bene aquí, bene aquí. Dale, agarrale el car, el de mio grocery. Hable, ¿por qué, man? A la pala, check ya daw sila, de mio back, sling back, check ya. Abre yo de mio sling back. Hable, oh, cosa man, se tal yo, pitaka, cosa, pero, relax, calma lang ba, yo, tatari lang yo. No hay man yo, cosa, aquí, pala, mira, cariño, agarra sila de mio sling back, y hace sila ansina, oh, pasa ba na, aquel chene, aquel tan, tit, tit, ansina, oh, hindi man, tas una, ah, 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 ara kumigo ya manda. Yo ta su naman. Ablay na ara ko sa man si Cheni kina di mio cuerpo. Manada ta mira. Mga tindera manada ta mira. Espanta ba sila kumyo? Ablay, de onde se di tu Europa? De abroad? Ablay yo, si, este palda de abroad. Este, ukay, ukay. Kabar, ala pa akin mo. Ah, baka ayin na di tu Europa. Ablay ko sa man. Bueno ke, ak, Akel kwan uno security, chenele eh, example, ko sa ba siguro chenele ya pasan sinesa kale. Ala pala, lego ma'am, yega to na kasa, check ya to se di to Europa, baka chene si ansiam. Porque ko sa gali, se, abla, chene daw se ali akal stainless, amo kal taswe na daw, na praise the Lord no, el Holy Spirit, pero chene, alegre lang yung kanila, hindi man yung ta chene miedo. Espanto, pero naman yung cosa talye ba? Ang sinan, sinan. Ang dato sa check ya, kay Chene got si ma'am. Abli, sige ma'am, thank you lang. Naamoy ya, Gael, kwando ya llega yun na casa, kita yun dahil di mi opalda, abli kumbrat. Bueno na'y kumigo ya man na kita di mi Europa. Praise the Lord, no tatari. Ang mga tindera, tamirang at kumigo. Tamira, abli, tatari lang tayo kanila. Abli, si thank you, check ya yun sa iya. Kwando ya check ya yun sa palda, maung, mira, mira, kasi kung sabah si Chene, ali, kay example, ya dali. Are, usay di mi antipara, ya mira, Chene, ang sina square, aki na site del, del, kwan, tabla ya, before you use, or you wash this one, remove, cut, ablay kumbrat, hala, este gali, kel, por esto gali, kosa yun, yas, ya kurta yun, Kuando ya kurta yo ya abri kami na siempre tan washing washing ya kel. Chene ate do ta brilla bale ang sina o komo na ang sina. Abri amo ste kay abri sila stainless daw. Amo abri ko saka ste no ino ino sen inorante gacho kay dali lang kan si abi kumigo na abroad. Ara yan ko anyo kun abi abri bi. No hay manka yan ko ambayo yan yan chat yo kun ele. Abri makarisa kumigo bueno na kumigo man da kita din yo pal double chene man yo tao sa doble. Makin kita sila. Ah amo kel. Ala pali na mang chene gat si mang abri may manka abla. Ya ma i chene gali dan sino. Tadayo gracias kun Lord kay si Lord ben bueno gat no el self control el Holy Spirit ta kikana to ni gat kita abla. Tarabya komo Leksyon kel, ablayo si ken mga sale abroad chene ken mga ansinansina, kita kel. Kaya mo gali kel taas si tapa sa kita, tut, tut, tut. Alo chene, ay talye ba ko sa, to God be the glory, God is so good, no? Thank you. Amen. Truly no, God is always there guiding us. Next, for the next one, Mr. Melanie. Good evening. Yo, I want to thank God for this. I said a week, very busy week, and 
Thank you, Lord, for His strength. Um, he's a great healer. Kasi si Eli last Sunday, um, tan fever le, and then tan duele at tan disuyod bariga. Kasi sensitivo ba kasi disuyod bariga? Able yon, hindi ka tahapil enemy. Tan test ka di ato na ano, faith. And then, when busy got kami na school, kaya chine kami district observation and monitoring. Ablo, Lord, lahe lang yun. Di miyo man taki, pero di miyo nisita yung man work. Ablo, yun tade, nandito yung man at kuneli. And then, yung kabagal Wednesday, ablo, ko di miyo head. Ano sir, nisisita yo bolbe kasi nisisita yo kay on and off this fever. Ablo yung Lord, may kamisin. And then, silibay ko na 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 doktor, man check it na niso yung blood. Tanwaras ka si Eli, si Saka, angry ba? Before kay le bolbe, ablo yung Lord, naban pa yung tares, ablo yung Lord. Sana okay si Eli. And then yali kayo na kasa. Thank you, Lord. May mele fever. I praise to God be all the glory. Amen. Now, let us all rise and shall we sing the song Great and Mighty is the Lord our God. testimony who is ready to give for the last testimony from the UFM testimony, I would like to praise and thank God that actually this, this is my second time to coordinate a presentation God that God is always there guiding and helping me. To God be all the glory. Again, shall we all rise and shall we continue worshiping the name of the Lord by singing the song, I just want to be where you are.
Hallelujah, Lord. Let's worship the Lord. You are worthy to be praised, O God. Hallelujah. Worthy is your name, O God. Hallelujah. We glorify your name, O God. We worship you, Lord. We exalt your name, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for your presence tonight, Lord, upon each one of us, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord. Worthy is your name, O God. Hallelujah. Worthy is your name. be seated. And for our live stream viewers, I would like to remind everyone that we also have Tuesday and Friday service. It starts at 6 p.m. And Sunday service, it starts at 10 a.m. And now, let's prepare our hearts for the Word of God to be given to us by our beloved Pastor Isaac Alisa. Let's welcome him by clapping our hands. Hallelujah. Let's bow down our head. Let's pray. Father, we thank you, Lord, for this evening. Once again, we are here in your house of worship to learn about your word because, Lord, we want to grow continually in you. And, Father, we ask God, Holy Spirit, be our portion this evening. Wisdom, knowledge, and understanding be upon us, O God. Anoint our, our ears and cultivate our heart, Father, as we learn your word. God, Holy Spirit, keep us away from any error. And we thank you, Lord, that what we are going to learn this evening will be established in our heart. This we ask and pray in Jesus' mighty name. And everybody says, Amen. Hey, my gabi. Good evening. Open your Bibles with me to the book of Matthew 25. Matthew 25. <clears throat> Earlier, the scripture reading was, the scripture reader read from verses 35 to 46. Now, this is a story, parable about the judgment of nations, but we will not be focusing on that. But just to give you the concept or the context of the story in this parable, this is the passage where Jesus said that the, the shepherd will divide and will separate the sheep from the goats. Okay, separate the sheep from the goats. 
Siyempre, no kere kita keda goat. Kere kita keda sheep. And so this evening, we will learn, and I hope it would heal us when it comes to this part. You know, not all believers are willing really to do like simple things of kindness. And tonight we will learn also that worship is not just singing. Okay, let's read once again. Matthew 25, verses 35 to 46. Let's read all together, reading go. For I was hungered, and you gave me meat. I was thirsty, and you gave me drink. I was a stranger, and you took me in. Naked, and you clothed me. I was sick, and you visited me. I was in prison, and you came unto me. Then shall the righteous answer him, saying, Lord, when saw we thee, and hungered, and fed thee, or thirsty, and gave thee drink? When saw we thee, a stranger, and took thee in, or naked, and clothed thee? Or when saw we thee sick, or in prison, and came unto thee? And the king shall answer, and say unto them, Verily I say unto you, Inasmuch as ye have done it unto one of the least of these my brethren, ye have done it unto me. Then shall he say also unto them on the left hand, Depart from me, ye curse, into everlasting fire, prepared for the devil and his angels. For I was unhungered, and ye gave me no meat. I was thirsty, and ye gave me no drink. I was a stranger, and ye took me not in. Naked, and ye clothed me not. Sick, and in prison, and ye visited me not. Then shall they also answer him, saying, Lord... When saw we thee, and hungered, or a thirst, or a stranger, or naked, or sick, or in prison, and did not minister unto thee? Then shall he answer them, saying, Verily I say unto you, Inasmuch as ye did it not to one of the least of this, ye did it not to me. And they shall go away into everlasting punishment, but the righteous into everlasting, into eternal life eternal. And so, like I said earlier, this is something that Silekita from 31 to 34, the king is saying that the shepherd is going to divide the sheep from the goat. And there's also one thing to note, kay Abla Palaki, and the righteous answered. Kasi Abla Manel King, I was thirsty, you gave me drink. I was hungry, you gave me food. I was naked, you clothed me. I was sick. You visited me when I was in prison. You came to me. And then the righteous answered, when? Quando? Everybody say righteous. You know, in this parable, puede, puede kita mira el difference between a righteous and a wicked person. <coughs> now, a righteous person, if we look at it, is someone who is filled with love. Amor. If, if we read the, the, the scriptures, the reason why Jesus has been reminding his apostles, actually the Bible says Jesus kanila, love one another. Now, not only love one another, but the Bible says, love your enemies. There's a verse gone in the Bible that says, if you have an enemy and if he, if he is hungry, feed him. And if he is thirsty, give him drink. And I know last time in preacher Konesia, pwede si kita uwi. But again, here comes Jesus telling his disciples. Why? Because Jesus is trying to instill in them not only love in words, but also in deeds. Hindi lang na kwento, pero na trabaho. I heard a story once, ala pale. 
Di ba, yauwi sa kita story, Akel, tiyene un gente, el sapatos, tan smile ya, tabria. Niya, galakaw siya ang sapatos, gaan, ano, ano. Niya, nakitaan sa usa ka tao, yun siya, kaluoy man ni. So, ya halale na bolsa, bingreso, katalsen. Pero halale na bolsa, pensaba pal gente, uy, dali ka, tesen, kay kumpre niyo mo sapatos. Hindi, gali. Ya sakali el goma, ya abla brad, hikti na imong sapatos. Abla pa sila, it's still an act of kindness daw, kaya dali daw goma. And so clearly, Jesus is saying that we should be willing to help, to give. Siyempre, we also help and give based on what we have. Pero have you noticed something here? Hindi man abla debe caro, hindi man abla debe grande at ito ayuda. The Bible even says even a glass of water It's good when you give. Pasaya dahil ito kong todo korason. You know, mostly arak, binmanada ka trason ka hindi po da yuda. Even if you don't have money, you can also always give your time and effort and show love. Amen ba? Are we willing? In this parable, the warning of Jesus regarding watching, being alert, and being ready reach a disturbing high point. It is because of God's warning, which is to separate the sheep from the goats. But there are criteria for the judgment. What's the difference between the sheep and the goat? Have you noticed something in a verse, El sheep, pati el goat, They're mixed together. That's why the shepherd must separate the sheep from the goat. Huntu. Mesklao. El mga sheep gali, hindi sa mga ploho. Why? Not only because... That person is filled with compassion, amor. The fact that you are going to give food and give drink, tasir bitu. The fact na anda tu bisita kami na tu is an act of service, and it's also effort. The fact that we are willing to go. Out of our comfort zone. Lalo ya si El Kungkentu Ayuda, rabiaw pa kuntigo. You know, when we can do that, it means we are really filled with the love of God. That's why as Christians, brothers and sisters, what Christ is saying here, yes, it could be literal giving food, it can be literal giving drink, it could be literal visiting because, para sa ganit, di ba, mas antes, yan ni kita jail ministry. Right? We pray for sick people. You know, the problem today is that si willing ba kita si ase? And when, when the Bible speaks of this, let us also look at it at a spiritual standpoint. People are also hungry and thirsty after God's word. People spiritually are in prison. Na preso sila. Why? Because of sin. The bondage of sin. People needs the Lord. What do we do? What do we do? Listen, there, there's one thing aki yan catch me attention. Listen to what it says, okay? We are studying this bonamente. 
In verse 40, abla pala, and the king shall answer and say unto them, Verily I say unto you, in so much as ye have done it unto one of the least of these my brethren, take note of the word brethren there. Ala pala, kaya pala na sila, Lord, kwando ba kami asistir para contigo? Yaw la pala, in so much as you, as you have you have done this to the least my brethren everybody say brethren in the book of mark chapter 3:33 to 35 it says and he answered them saying who is my mother or my brethren and he looked round about on them which sat about him and said behold my mother and my brethren for whosoever shall do the will of God, the same is my brother and sister and mother. It means that el mga righteous aki is considered his brethren. When we are called his brethren, then we are righteous than worship. Pero kosa el requirement debe. We should be willing to work in God's vineyard. If we look at these brothers and sisters, hindi gat galit pwede abla to disciple to the Lord kabar hindi to willing trabahan na di si Vineyard. Na kere to sinta lang to sitting pretty. Na eto lang anda man share, eto lang man visitation. No ay mas problema, basta ya abuya lang yung Domingo, okay ya. All of us has a role to play. Amen ba? And so if we want to be part of God's brethren, if we want to be part of God's righteous people, if we want to be part of the sheep, we need really to do the will of God. And that is one thing we need to hear in this day and age. Lalo ya if we see the day of Christ fastly approaching. Because if you want to be prepared, hindi se pwede na no'y kita ko sa taas para kun Lord. There's a verse in the Bible that says that the fullness of Christ can only be seen when we do God's work. When we do the will of God. And so, si pregunta ka natin si Lord, when I was hungry, sino pa mga Christian? Ay, maya, may dalik ko nese. Sino pa mga Christian? The willing ayuda. Wala yan bless yung si Lord, mas takeda boxer almano. Kaya di siya mas takeda lagak. And not only that. The Bible says, blessed are the feet of those who brings the gospel of peace. You know what, brothers and sisters, if we truly commit ourselves to do the will of God, we will truly see great and mighty things. Because if God sees that we are truly working and committed in His vineyard, the Bible says, and these signs shall follow them that believe. These signs shall follow those who preach the gospel. And so I would like to encourage everyone tonight, and even the viewers, Debe chene kita na diatong corazon, willing kita anda to feed the hungry, to give drink to the thirst, thirsty, to visit those who are sick, to clothe those who are naked, visita ka tayo na preso. Hindi kita debe tamploho. And you know what? Every time we 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 do things for the Lord, we should be serious about it. You know, manada, manada willing gayot na kwento lang. Pero si Ora Asida ya, manada no kere ya. 
And that's the reality. And God is going to separate the sheep from the goats. One of, one of the character of goats are lazy. No kere sila trabaha. Listen to what Micah says. Micah chapter 6, verse 6 to 8. Wherewith shall I come before the Lord and bow myself before the high God? Shall I come before him with burnt offerings, with calves of a year old? Will the Lord be pleased with thousands of rams or with ten thousands of rivers of oil? Oil, shall I give my firstborn for my transgression, the fruit of my body for the sin of my soul? Listen to what he said. He had showed thee, O man, what is good and what doth the Lord require of thee but to do justly and to love mercy and to walk humbly with thy God. It means this, to show kindness to people. To be a just person. It's not the burnt offerings that God wants. Listen to what Jesus has been telling his disciples. Love one another. Love your enemies. Love your neighbors as you love yourself. Last Tuesday, we, were, uh, we learned that we should love God with all of our heart. This evening, if there's one thing that we should learn also is to love others and be willing to help others. As Christians, hindi kita pwede sinta lang mira kita di ato mga hermano, hermana tan lisod. Man pray lang kita para kanila. Kabar chen na kita. We have the means that we can help others. Ay numaya kasi mira tuo. Palta pa siya ng aros, pero lila aros, may manada pa kayo. May I ask you, are we willing to help? Are we willing to show kindness? Are we willing to lend a helping hand? Are we willing to visit those who are sick? Are we willing to visit those who need help? Are we willing to go and share the gospel of peace to others? Willing bakita. The reason why again Jesus tells them this because Christ is really instilling into them tapon negat kanila manda kanila entende why? Because in the last days, if there's one thing that will wax cold and that is love if there is no love there will be no love for others in the last days love for others will wax cold but love for oneself in a selfish way if you look at things today most people are into their own selves lang that's why the bible tells us in Matthew 24, verse 12, iniquity shall abound because the love of many shall wax cold. In 2 Timothy 3, 2, it says, For men shall be lovers of their own selves. And in the last days, men shall be lovers of money. To the point they're not willing to help, but they're willing to step on others just to have money. Sad to say, there are people, Ansina, who goes to church. And so when the time comes, Christ, who is the good shepherd, everybody say with me, good shepherd, will separate the sheep from the goats. Again, like I said earlier, for eso ni sita leman separate kasi yan hunto. Many think that the sheep kapensa sila is inside the church and the goats are outside the church. No. 
When the time comes, God is going to separate the sheep from the goats. And what's the basis that is you? Is what we have done for the Lord. Al ko sa kita, ya ase para kun Lord. The sheep, those on the right hand, are blessed and, in, and inherit the kingdom prepared for them from the beginning of the world. The goats, on the other hand, are cursed and cast into eternal fire. And so the, the sheep is for eternal life. The goats is for eternal fire. But what are the criteria for this judgment? What has the one group done that the other group has not? The goats are so busy with their religion and hypo hypocritical worship of God that they do not take time for the poor and helpless. Listen to what the Bible says. James 1.27 Pure religion and undefiled before God and the Father is this, to visit the fatherless and the widows in their affliction and to keep himself unspotted from the world. Did you get that? To visit the fatherless and the widows in their affliction. Normally, those who are fatherless and those who are widows in this, when you look at this, are people who are poor, are people who are suffering, are people who need help. This is what the Bible says. Brothers and sisters, then mention you denante about the spiritual thing that we may we must go and visit them and, and 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 share to them the gospel, give them Jesus Christ. Amen. But listen to me. May I ask you, are you blessed by God financially? Are you blessed by God materially? Yes or no? There's a reason why God has blessed you. It's not for us to be rich. It's for us to be able to bless others. And if you want greater blessings from God, learn how to bless others. You will see how God is going to bless you more. Because once you are blessed by the Lord, you will be blessed by the Lord. I cannot trust this person. Si ito gente, pirmi lang ito kere contigo lang mambles, kere lang ito pirmi recibi. That's the reason why you're always in, doon akal tutan, asaya lang ito pirmi. On which side do you want to be? Contigo tadali or ito tadali? On which side do you want, want to be? Contigo tadali or ito tadali? Do you know the difference between si ito tadali? It means you really have more than enough? Si kun pimino to tarisi bi pimino to la Lord baka ulat na ko makaon oh ma mahulat na lang ko kay sister unya mahuman ang service dinan ko muuli dayon maglingkod sa uli ri Agoy logi negosyo wala man gyud nanghatag sa ako Hello Yes we know there are people who's like that Hindi tabla ta espera kay nisisita ta espera no I mean there are people who really needs help and so what I'm telling is this. And when you start helping others, don't even try to announce it. Just give it silently. God knows if you're helping people. It's between you and God. But I encourage you, really help others. Pwede ayuda, porke man, no? Kila yung dali 100. Amoy lang si Dimisen. Kwanto ba ito yung sen? 1,000. Ah, tiyan naman galito 1,000. Pwede kito dali 100. Tamira dito yung hermano, hermano na ipasahin. Now, let us also be wise. Siyempre, we help. Pero otro at naman yung kalsi at kalhente kung kikita ayuda, loho gayot, kikita. Yan, sabi na kayo tayo daw ko nila eh. 
We need to also to teach them how to fish. Amen ba? Para kang hente, kung kain kita yoy da, agon diya, ele tamen tayo da otro hente. And this is what we need to do. Give them Jesus Christ, si unbeliever man, si Christian man, let's help one another. Amen ba? Amen ba? Kaya no ay goat ginda na siya lo. Sabi ko sa tayo sa mga karakter na goat, loho, lagak, el pensamiento, pirmi lang mabuling. Si Ayo dahil un brother, hay, nagpasikat na po siya. Kung wala na tagaan, lanto ka, lagak ka ayo. Wala yun ka, para asa. You would know a person if that person is a goat. There's two kinds of critical thinking. El uno, dos critical, otro, el uno critical thinker. It means, Porte man analyze. El uno tamen, bisya-bisya lang, buska lang mali. Ito critical na yun na lugar. Those are goats. Those are goats. And so we must be willing to help. We must be willing to give food to the hungry. We must be willing to give drink to the thirsty. We must be willing to visit the sick. We must be willing to clothe the those who are naked. And we must be willing to visit those who are in prison. You can look at those things in two ways. Spiritual way and physical. Hungry and thirsty after God's word. Naked because they are not clothed in righteousness. Sick, spiritually, tatumba sila. In prison, because they're still in bondage of sin. And so, this lang. Hindi lang kita akal si, akal, kung ganit, amen, are we willing to go, amen, pero sa na andeta, o sa tayo lang. Hindi sa pwede. Are we a goat or a sheep? Are we a goat or a sheep? Again, a sheep, hindi ploho. Hindi lagak. Sabi sa isipan? Nakata kung tatrabaho ba? Sige, nalag ako. Yeah, lampir mi. May isipan. Ya, ya trabaho lang una bes, di na ko kay nagbuhat na ko ana. No. And so a sheep is a worshiper. Everybody say with me worshiper. We are still kasi labla ki. The sheep recognizes that through worship. Everybody say with me through worship. Through worship of God involves taking care of the poor and helpless. That's why I read to you earlier the book of Micah 6, 6 to 8, and James 1, 27. Worship is not just singing. You know, many people would think that, ay, mag-worship na ko kay Matusimbat, kay maulan na akong tayo mag-worship. And when they think of singing, is equivalent to worship. No, even us helping the poor, even us helping, visiting the poor, the sick people, it's a form of worship. Once we do things as unto the Lord. And so, brothers and sisters, kinsa di rin nag-aad na Bible study and visiting the poor. That's a form of worship. When you give Christ to them, you're doing as unto the Lord. That, as, that is also, and you do it with all of your heart to, the, to God, it's also a form of worship because for worship is not just singing, it's a way of life. Hello. The fact that you go to church because you love God is one way of worship. 
The fact that you wake up early because you love God and you want to spend time with Him, that's a form of worship. In everything that we do, we must do it as unto the Lord. And the sheep who are righteous, who are the brethren of Christ, understands this. That's why, Mirostedes, Ablakan is the Lord, diba? Do it as unto the Lord. Everybody say with me, do all things as unto the Lord. Have you noticed something? Ya pregunta sila kun 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 el king kun the Lord. Cuando se kami hace? Cosa habla Dios? Cosa habla el Lord? When you did these things, you know why? God saw their heart because they have done it as unto God. Yes, you can go visiting, you can go asina, pero mira si Lord dito yung corazón. And it all go back na ko sa level ng Matthew 7. Only those who do the will of my Father. Pensaba nga niya antes, brothers and sisters, it's really okay to be a Christian. Sinta lang yun na bangko, uwi na sermon, resa aga, kabraasta alya lang. Everybody say with me the word disciple. Would you agree with me that those who goes to heaven are disciples of Christ? Yes or no? Only those who are disciples or followers. Yes or no? We are still this. Manada yan follow kon Christ. Pero di gal tiempo ya bira sila. Kwanto ya keda? Dose. Because not all who follows him follows him with whole heart. Listen to what Jesus said to Peter. Peter, do you love me? Kosa ba si Peter? Yes, Lord. Kosa ba si Lord? Feed my Three times ko nila pregunta. Now I will ask you this. Do you love Jesus? Do you love Jesus? Yes or no? Hello, tatandos, tos. Tama sa sabi yung unistan na si pastor. Do we love Jesus? And so if we love Jesus, are we willing to do El cosa que te aprende ara. Feed the poor. Give them drink. Clothe those who are naked. Visit the sick and those who are in prison. Are we willing to do that? Yanante, do you love Jesus? Manada. Ara, dol akia lang yo. Are we willing? Amen ba? Amen ba? Nung mga blakay ay okay lang si pastor ba? Sa end of the iglesia, okay. No. I always remember kasi abla kumigo mi tata antes. Abla kumigo. Just make sure everything you're doing right now is acceptable before God. And I ask him, pakilaya man, kira di sir, el things, el kosa lang mira si Lord, things that are done for Christ, under the church. Abla, no. Alala la kumigo este. Whatever you do, if it is done as unto the Lord, it is done for Christ. But listen carefully. It means if you do things for Christ, you will never do wicked things. Hello? Redeeming the time. For the days are evil. You know, we can always share the gospel. For example, din ante dos man sino? Spiritual and physical. El otro, ande el gas, man share el gospel, praise the Lord. Pero kabakel, bin lagak gayot, kin man man bless. El otro tamen, bin grabe man give. Hindi man tadali el gospel, kilaya man save. You know what's the best thing? 
Pero sa tanbro, mas kami antes. El Bible study or el outreach na komida hindi biblical. Diyan si joke. You know why? Because when we give outreach, we also show kindness to the people. It's not to lure them. Remember, when we go outreach to communities, most of them are poor and needy. Are you listening? Amen ba? And so, when the time comes, I hope you will be willing to visit those who are in need. Amen ba? Because if we are called and we are sheep, we would recognize these things. Look around you before we pray. Mira tu. Look around you. May I ask you something? Who among you here, before kung Kristo, you really need Jesus? And the reason why you came to know Christ is because someone showed you the way, who visited you. Kaya araw man lagak kita. No ma. Let us go. Amen ba? Para si Liga El Chempo, aula pa si Lord. Pep, bisita yun na GNT. Oh, hala, adale. I don't need to separate anything because everything I see is sheep. Amen ba? Aula to na dito side, be a sheep. Yes. Last Tuesday, he enseñed kita about loving God. It will not be complete because the Bible says the great commandment is what? Love the Lord your God with all of your heart, with all of your mind, with all of your strength. In short, with all of who you are. Amen. Kabarastaya lang no? Hindi. The second is alike unto the first. Love your neighbors. As you love yourself. And the Bible does not say, man visit lang to el kung ken lang to comfortable man visit. The Bible pa na Bible. Siya ayuda to na dito yu amigo lang gayot. Kosa mangkel. Why not try to help someone? Who, is, who really needs it? Why? Because if you show love only to those who are close contigo, even the publicans can do that. Kasi ang dos man sa tapasa, siya na besta sobra kita, ayaw da apwera to obidad kita di atun hermano, hermana, aki na iglesia. Brothers and sisters, el oto tamen, Sobre kita, ayuda kita, olvida kita, pwera. No. But always remember, si Chene kita man help, we start here, and then we go outside. Amen ba? Amen ba? Let's start showing kindness. And I know we show kindness one to another. And not only kindness, but let us start showing Jesus in us. Ay grabe el heart ni Jesus for the poor, for the needy, for the widows, for the fatherless. And let us also have that heart. Let us all stand. Hallelujah. You know, we can never do these things. Hindi si kita pwede ase, si di atong korason, boss. Hindi si pwede kita pwede ase, si di atong korason, akel, tamira kita, alto kat kita na mahente. We cannot do those things if our heart is filled with pride. 
We cannot do those things. Si El Diaton, Mirada, hindi. Debe si Kumigo sila sirbi. We can only do those things if we have a servant heart. To love one another, to serve one another, to submit one to another. Hindi kita se pwede si Chene kita maldito or maldita heart. Hindi se pwede si You know, if ansina dia tong corazon, it means we really need to check ourselves. If we cannot love the unlovable, we really need to check ourselves. Kasi no maana ito pensaman visit, if you cannot love the unlovable, you know why? Everything you will do would be in vain. Or it's not hatred, agoy, useless. But the only way to do these things is to have a servant heart. And how do we have that? The Bible says, Jesus says this, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy, and I will give you rest. He says, take my yoke upon you and learn of me. Learn from Him. For I am meek and lowly in. And so when we learn from Christ, we'll be influenced by Christ. Because in reality, brothers and sisters, all of us needed Christ. And we still need Him. That's why we come to Him. It was Christ who first visited the poor. Gave, showed mercy. Set the captives free. And so we are witnesses of His goodness. We are witnesses and we can testify of what God has done for us. And so it's our turn because not only we have experienced it, we have learned from Him. So it's our turn as His disciples to do what Christ has done for us. Siyempre, ya usa le gente kel para kita conoce con ele. Ya usa le gente para ayuda ka natin. It's our turn and say, Lord, here I am, use me. I am your sheep. I don't want to become a goat. You know, there are still many Christians today who really don't grasp the, the, the weight of this. That they're just willing to Pensa ba sila, okay lang akil abuya lang iglesia? Iga ba kumigo antes, tuka, sale na iglesia? Abuya Tuesday, Friday, Sunday. And the Lord told me, you're not even a born again Christian. I hope na no, yung makanatong kaya nablan si na kisi Lord. Because when the time comes, When you will actually hear these words, depart from me. I don't think so. It would be something pleasing to hear. All of us wants to listen these words from God. Well done. Everybody say with me, well done. My faithful servant. You know why it's well done? Kasi chene to ko saya ase. Hindi kontigo abla el unhente well done sino ito ko saya ase. Hindi to kay chene ko saya ase para salba kontigo. No, it means this: we have worked in his vineyard. He that winneth souls is wise. And how do we win souls? We visit the poor. We feed the hungry and the thirsty. We visit the sick. We visit those who are in prison. We clothe those who are naked. Can we sing the song, Make Me a Servant, Humble, 
Amen. servant servant make me a servant make me a servant today if there's one healing that we need to have this evening el datong corazón that we will have a servant heart like God like Christ the epitome because I got a servant. A God who didn't see it as robbery for him to be made lower than the angels gave his life for you and I. If you're not feeling well this evening, just raise your hands towards God. Tonight is divine healing night. You know, God still heals. Before I'll pray, listen to this. Yesterday evening, I was not feeling well. Early this morning, as we, I had my time with God, I say, Lord, I still believe you're a God who heals. I need your divine healing. After I prayed, I was totally healed. God is good. God is good. And so if you're not feeling well right now, if you're having anything, you feel pain, may I remind you, God is still in the business of healing. Basta numa, ase arriba el miracle contra con el Dios. Mostly today, they focus on the miracle, not on Jesus Christ. May I tell you something? That's why most of them do not receive the healing. Focus on Christ. The miracle will just happen. There will be no miracle without Jesus Christ. So if you're not feeling well, just lift up your hands. And I believe God is going to heal you tonight. Oh, let's pray. Hallelujah. 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 We bless your name. We magnify your name, oh God. We magnify your name, oh Jesus. The precious blood of the Lamb that will never lose His power. Father, we come to You right now by the name of Jesus Christ, by the Lamb of God that was slain. Lord, we ask of You right now, Lord, to let Your precious blood flow from Your throne of grace down to the head, to the bodies, to the soles of the feet of those who are in pain, who is not feeling well right now, in Jesus' mighty name. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever you're the same God who opened the Red Sea you're the same God who raised people from the dead and you're the same God who's going to heal your people right now in Jesus mighty name Lord walay sakit na mas gamhanan sa imo 
You are a big God. You are the God of all flesh and there's nothing too hard for you to do. You are the doctor of all doctors. You are the God who heals and we claim it right now. We stand in your word. Precious blood of Jesus. Bless his name. Bless his name. Hallelujah. Bless his name. Thank God for the healing. Bless his name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He touched me. Oh, he touched me. And all the joy that floods my soul. Something happened, and now I know He touched me and me. Let's sing it once again and sing it with faith, believing that God has healed you. He touched me. Oh, He touched me And all the joy that floods my soul Something happened And now I know He touched me Before we close in prayer, let's just thank God for the healing. Let's just thank God for the answer. Let's bless His name. Let's adore His name. For He is worthy to be praised. He is worthy to be adored. He is worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Exalt the name of Jesus. Exalt His holy name. Exalt His holy name. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Lord, for the answer. Thank you, Lord, for the answer. Thank you, Lord, for your touch. Thank you, Lord, for your touch upon your people. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be the lamb that was slain, the perfect lamb of God. Blessed be the name of Jesus, the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, wonderful is your name. Wonderful is your name, Lord. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you, Lord, for this evening. Lord, we thank you for your goodness. And we believe, Lord, you have touched your children. People are healed because of who you are and what you are. Because of your presence, because of your love, because of your grace. And we thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord Jesus. We also thank you for the word this evening. We thank you, Lord, for allowing us to be here. Indeed, Lord, we are blessed because we have learned from your word. And Father, we are blessed with your presence. And so, Lord, as we depart from this place, we know, Lord, we will be going home rejoicing. Rejoicing, oh God, because we know that your smile, God, Holy Spirit, is upon us. And Lord, your people are being rejuvenated, encouraged, show oh God, and blessed by your presence. Bless your children, your protection to be upon us as we go home, Lord. Thank you, Lord, blessing everyone, blessing every family, blessing every household. We know, Lord, and we thank you for the good things that you have done and the things that you're about to do in our lives. This we ask and pray in Jesus' mighty name. And everybody shout praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen and amen. Good evening to all and God bless you.